Today we will be continuing part 9 of this manhwa. Lu Xing murmured and began to read this exercise. By the time he had read all of the exercises, he could no longer find words to describe the incredible feeling in his heart. Fantastic! Unbelievable! This is Lu Xing's evaluation of this exercise. Of course, it is also unimaginably powerful. No wonder the fighting skills didn't appear just now. Although this technique is within the skill range of spiritual masters, it is also specially created for combat, but it is not entirely a skill. The core of divine illumination of king of hell is very simple, and it can be summed up in one sentence. It is to use mental power to build another body in the warrior's body. A body is completely woven from spiritual power. You can also say separate. And the sophistication of this mental body can reach the level of muscle fibers, cells, and even genes, and the function of building such a spiritual power clone is only to amplify yourself. An amplification without dead ends in all directions. The first level of the divine illumination of king of hell is to use mental power to promote the body to speed up the operation so as to achieve the effect of increasing qi and blood. When Lu Xing saw it for the first time, he thought he was wrong. Whether it is the perfect boxing method, the power of the stars, the natural breathing method, or the spiritual force, they all rely on special force-generating techniques, or additional driving force, to stimulate the collision between muscles, so as to achieve the effect of a more powerful destructive driving force. His basic blood value will not change. And divine illumination of king of hell directly broke this point, and it increased chi and blood. The follow-up introduction is even more exaggerated to the extent that it can increase all attribute abilities, including the effect of mental power itself. This is simply outrageous. There are indeed some means of temporarily bursting chi and blood. But that is only a way to temporarily increase the qi and blood value by suddenly stimulating the potential. It is completely different from what is described in the Divine Illumination of King of Hell. No wonder the Divine Illumination of King of Hell is not divided into entry level and advanced levels. Just give me the full copy, and the third level authority can search it. Because wanting to use mental power to completely build a perfect clone, this is undoubtedly an extremely huge project. It takes too much time and energy, and at the same time, you must have a sufficient understanding of your own body structure. Lu Xing took a deep breath and tried to calm the stirring emotions in his heart. I still underestimate the 10,000-year wisdom crystallization of martial arts. This kind of cultivation method, let alone created now, can't even think of it. Lu Xing kept the name Duan Feng in his heart. The characters who can create the crystal contemplation technique and divine illumination of the king of hell at the same time are worthy of his admiration from the bottom of his heart. It is rare for a civilization to breed such a character. I am afraid that even among the eleventh level powerhouses, this Duan Feng should be regarded as an absolute top existence. It is an eleventh level powerhouse itself, and after going through the divine illumination of king of hell to increase it in an all-round way, how can it be so good? But even such a character cannot support the collapsed human civilization. Lu Xing was silent. It turns out that my idea is correct. The ultimate goal of martial arts practice is ultimately one's own. Even an eleventh level spiritual master will finally take the path of using spiritual power to enhance himself. Lu Xing didn't delay any longer, turned off the light brain, and practiced directly in the dream space. He has a lot to do, and he still has a long way to go. Every minute, every second, can't afford to delay. A month had passed, and inside a certain psychic training room in the camp, sounds could be heard from outside. Xiao Lin was standing on strange box patterns that seemed to be releasing some sort of energy. She had been practicing inside a dark and airtight small room to master her psychic energy control. As she took her stance, the mechanism inside the room released some spherical projections targeted at Xia Lin. Their speed was extremely fast that it cannot be seen with the naked eye. As the balls approached Xia Lin, some purple rays burst through the balls destroying each and every one of them. There was a constant sound of something breaking through the room, followed by the sound of something falling to the ground. 
The balls were illusions created by the training room mechanism to practice psychic energy control and manipulate it efficiently. When the lights in the room turned on, Xiao Lin opened her eyes. It can be seen that three alls the size of ping-pong balls are suspended around her like planets with her psychic energy to practice her long and mid-range combat techniques. Under her feet, the ground was covered with tennis balls with a small hole in the middle. Xiao Lin's face paled slightly, and her forehead was covered with a fine sweat. The door opened, and Dong Qingxue walked in from the door. That's right, you've made rapid progress, and you've been able to master three-star cones. When you can master controlling six cones at a time, it means you've officially entered the level of a first-level spiritual teacher. Thank you, Chief Instructor, for the guidance of the Chief Instructor. When Xiao Lin saw Dong Qingxue stand up quickly, she said hello seriously. Dong Qingxue looked at Xiao Lin in front of her with a hint of approval in her eyes. She nodded and said, It's inseparable from your own talent and hard work. After complimenting Xiao Lin, Dong Qingxue suddenly frowned and said, But I found one thing, there seems to be a big loophole in your mind, Will. What's going on? Did someone leave with some kind of mental trauma before? Xiao Lin was startled, and a handsome, cold, and terrifying profile appeared subconsciously in her mind. She gritted her teeth and admitted, Yes, Chief Instructor. The most taboo thing for spiritual teachers is the spiritual loophole. You should pay attention to this problem, Dong Qingxue said seriously. Excuse me, instructor, is there any way to make up for the loophole? It's actually very simple, Dong Qingxue replied to Xia Lin. Dong Qingxue said lightly, Find the person who left you with a loophole, and then defeat or kill him. If you can do so your mental trauma will naturally disappear. Defeat or kill? Xia Lin was startled then lowered her head and began to consider the possibility of achieving these two goals. Seeing her hesitation, Dong Qingxue couldn't help but say, You are now in a period of rapid growth and strength. It's not difficult to do this. Isn't it difficult? Xiao Lin bit her lip. A lot of entanglement and fear flashed across her expression. I heard that the terrible guy has been in a state of decadence all this time. If his strength has always stopped in place and she wants to defeat him, maybe she really can, maybe. How about it? Is it over? Dong Qingxue walked out of the room, leaving Xia Lin alone to think about training, and bumped into Qin Xiaojun who was waiting at the door. The talent is very good, but the character still needs to be sharpened. It's too weak. Dong Qingxue commented eloquently. Be soft on the outside and tough on the inside, you can teach it slowly. Qin Xiaojun comforted him, and then said, I regret that it was too late for my decision. Dong Qingxue wondered, What's wrong? Meng Jinha's talent is not good? Qin Xiaojun said with a wry smile, The talent is okay, it's just the character. Hey, let's not mention it. Dong Qingxue said lightly, I've already taught it, let's just teach it to the end. Anyway, it only took a month or two to bite my teeth and it's over. All right. Qin Xiaojun was a little helpless. Oh, right. Dong Qingxue suddenly remembered something, looked at Qin Xiaojun, and said, Lu Xing, is it still the same? Hearing Dong Qingxue mention this name, Qin Xiaojun was stunned for a moment, then nodded. It's still the same. He only goes out three times a day. Other than that, he stays in the dormitory. No one knows what he's doing there. Remember what you said while lecturing the students? If they wish they can stay in dorms and just sleep their days away, no one will interfere in their affairs. Qin Xiaojun said. I shouldn't have said that in the first place. Dong Qingxue suddenly said with some hatred. Back then, she told everyone at the meeting that she and Qin Xiaojun would not interfere with anyone's cultivation methods. As long as you liked it, no one would care if you stayed in the dormitory and slept every day. Who would have thought that some people would actually stay in the dormitory every day and sleep hard? A very good seedling. How did it become like this? Dong Qingxue shook her head with regret and sighed. Qin Xiaojun couldn't help but ask. Why don't you use him as a whetstone? Shut up. He not even worthy of becoming a stepping stone now. 
Dong Qingxiu walked out without looking back. Just let him be, teach your Ming Jin Ha well, or Xiao Lin will beat him badly in the closed camp assessment. Who is afraid of whom? Qin Xiao Jun shouted in disapproval. Then, as if remembering something, he sighed softly. In the cafeteria, Yang Yuan was holding a mop in both hands, trying to fight against the stains on the ground. She had been working too hard to earn points to keep moving forward. In order to earn points she had been doing all sorts of miscellaneous tasks the camp assigned. Yang Yuan, haven't you done it yet? I'll help you. A girl walked in and saw Yang Yuan mopping the floor, so she naturally picked up a mop and ran over to help. Thanks. Yang Yuan stopped, wiped the sweat from her forehead, and showed a grateful smile to the girl. What's the matter? You didn't help me before. Hurry up and get it done, or you'll have to stay up all night tonight. The girl sighed and worked hard. Although the movements are not standard, they are quite skilled. Yang Yuan nodded with a complicated expression. It has been almost a month since she entered the training camp. During this time, she can be said to have had a difficult time. Points are required for eating, drinking, and living in the training camp, and points are also required to experience a better cultivation environment. Yan Yuan dragged the ground silently, without saying a word. Suddenly, the girl's words caused her body to vibrate slightly. Yang Yuan, what do you think Lu Xing has been doing all this time? Hiding in the room all day and not coming out, learning the ancient martial arts masters in the novels to retreat and practice? Don't you have a good relationship with him? Do you know? The movements of Yang Yuan's hands paused and soon returned to normal. I have no idea, the girl sighed and said. I guess you don't know either. You said that Lu Xing is also, I don't know what kind of plane he is working on. When he came in, he was so fierce that everyone in the camp lost their temper. The result was good, and it wilted the next day. The girl picked up the mop in her hand and dipped it in the bucket, then shook her head and said, More than a month has passed, and everyone, including those of us who can't get along, has improved by leaps and bounds. There are several who have broken through the second-level martial arts. Lu Xing stayed behind closed doors, it is estimated that his strength has long been caught up by others, catching up. Yan Yuan, do you think he is afraid? He knew that there would be such a result, so he would simply shrink his head and increase the sense of mystery around him? The girl looked at Yan Yuan steadily and asked. In Yan Yuan's mind, a figure belonging to that young man could not help but emerge. When not moving like ice, silent, calm, Loki. When it erupted, it was like a volcano, wanton and arrogant, like a devil who controls everything. No, Lu Xing is not that kind of person, Yan Yuan said firmly in her heart. Yan Yuan picked up the mop and poked it hard into the bucket, splashing the ground. She smiled reluctantly and comforted. You rest, I will do the rest myself. After speaking, clean up silently and stop talking. Have you heard? Chao Yong from Yanglin City has already started to challenge the quadruple gravity room. The girl who helped drag the floor next to Yang Yuan raised her head, and they both looked in a direction. Someone shouted from a distance. Could it be fake? Chao Yong will immediately attack the third level martial artist. After the third level, he can challenge the higher gravity chamber. Refresh the training camp record. You didn't see the faces of those people. Another voice came ringing out. Yan Yuan was shocked. Quadruple gravity. She remembered that she only stayed in the double gravity room for more than twenty minutes last time, and she almost carried it on her back, so she had to come out early. The points wasted made her feel bad. Quick, let's go take a look. The girl held Yan Yuan's hand as she tried to take her to the gravity room to witness the rumors. Lu Sheng, just what on earth are you doing right now? Yan Yuan sighed in her heart after hearing the record being broken. Just as someone's name, glory, and oppression gradually faded out of everyone's sight, the door of a single-person dormitory in the training camp finally opened at a different time from the past. Quietly open. The sun shines through the branches of the tree leaves in front of the dormitory door and sprinkles on Lu Xing's face, and it falls a little mottled. Lu Xing narrowed his eyes and stared at the pair of flower-tailed finches on the branch for a while. 
It wasn't until they flew away that Lu Xing took his eyes back. It's been a month. Lu Xing sighed softly. I want to find a place where I can properly verify the growth of my strength. Lu Xing looked at his hands and said to himself. Soon, he thought. Lu Xing raised his foot and walked to a location marked on the base map in his memory. He was so fast that he disappeared in the blink of an eye. In a room with six walls of black lead like a rock, a strong body sat quietly crossed. In the gravity training hall, inside the room, there was an eighteen-year-old boy. He has dark skin and an ordinary appearance, but there is a trace of perseverance and fierceness in his eyebrows. The teenager stood in the center of the room, motionless, but seemed to be under extremely strong pressure, and the muscles all over his body were shaking slightly. Sweat condensed into a stream, slowly flowing down from the gully of his muscles, and the bottom was already wet. He tried to lift half of his finger, moved it little by little, and tapped a white remote control of unknown material beside him. With the sound of dripping, the air in the whole room seemed to be light. The young man exhaled and walked towards the door, with a series of bone-crunching sounds from his whole body. The boy walked out of the room, and a boy who had been waiting at the door immediately handed him a dry white towel. The young man took it, wiped the sweat off his body, and asked casually, How long did you last this time? Three minutes and fifty-two seconds. The boy quickly reported a number with excitement and admiration on his face. Chao Yong, you are really strong. Just now I thought you were going to be unable to hold on, so I almost gave you a pause outside, but I didn't expect you to hold on for another thirty seconds. There is a huge one-way glass outside the gravity training room. People standing outside can clearly see the situation inside, which avoids the tragedy of people in the room because the gravity is too high and physical exhaustion cannot stop training. Is it just over a minute longer than last time? Chao Yong frowned and turned to the boy. Next time I go in, I won't stop by myself. Just leave the strength to move my little finger, and when you see my action, give it to me immediately. I pause. It is good, the boy said with admiration. Chao Yong, you are so desperate, you will soon be able to fully adapt to quadruple gravity and break through the third-level martial artist. Who else will be your opponent in the entire training camp? A third-level warrior? Chao Yong read a sentence but did not speak. Chao Yong felt a bit of pain in his forehead and remembered the time when Lu Xing gave him a flick, so he asked the boy. What about Lu Xing? The boy hesitated for a moment and said, Chao Yong, that Lu Xing from Baiha City is still the same. He doesn't go out or practice every day except for meals. Chao Yong gave an arrogant smile and said, How arrogant! Even I was no match for him back then. No matter how slow a turtle is, it will still be able to catch up to a sleeping rabbit. Moreover, he has been sleeping for over a month now. What a waste of one thousand points. While chatting, a figure came across them. This person is just walking, but the speed is very fast. Just in a blink of an eye, the people standing near the gravity room lose each other's figure in front of them. It just felt like a gust of wind was blowing across their face. When they came back to their senses, they were surprised to find that their bodies had turned sideways for some reason, and the middle just made way for a person to pass through. The two stared at each other. Lu Xing, that guy is Lu Xing from Baiha City! The companion cried out with excitement. Is this the so-called gravity training room? Lu Xing looked at the small room in front of him. There is a huge one-way glass on the wall outside the room, which can clearly see the scene inside the room. It was empty inside, the walls were pure black. This guy hasn't been out of the room much since the second day he entered the camp. Except for the cafeteria, he has never been to other places. He actually came to the training hall today after a month of sleeping in his dorm. The eyes of Chao Yong suddenly lit up. Lu Xing took out his ID card and swiped it on the card machine outside the gravity training room. Lu Xing has a total of 1,000 points and after staying in the room for so long, there is still a lot left. Ten points for an hour. Lu Xing thought for a while and decided. Then let's come for three hours first. Anyway, it's still early for dinner. The credit card machine deducted points. Lu Xing walked to the center of the room, 
and there was a white remote control on the ground. At a glance, you can see that this is used to adjust the gravity multiplier. Let's try doubling the gravity first. Then the door of the training room made a beep sound, and the door opened automatically. Lu Xing walked in saying, Has it been a month? Just as well I can find out how much I have grown. You were sleeping all the freaking time and you are expecting to have grown. What kind of joke is that? A voice came as the door to the gravity room was closing. It was Chao Yong. No deep breaths, no preparation. Lu Xing just casually pressed the start button of the remote control in his hand. What, doesn't this guy need to warm up? Outside the gravity room, Chao Yong couldn't help but blurt out when he saw Lu Xing reaching out his hand to press the start button. This guy has been out of the rhythm of training camp for too long, and he doesn't even have basic common sense. Chao Yong said, The gravity training room is not a joke, it is a formal martial artist, and the musculoskeletal muscles may not matter, they can withstand sudden changes in external pressure. But the fragile internal organs are not so easy. If you don't warm up first and prepare for relevant preparations, it is easy to cause internal organs to rupture and bleed. Forgot when we first went in. It's good to make him so crazy before. It's good to have a long memory. Gravity on notification sound. The three boys stared at Lu Xing in the room with smiles, preparing to watch the show next. Anyway, the practice outdoor is one-way glass, so there is no need to worry about being discovered by Lu Xing. Why didn't you respond? A boy took a special look to the side. There was a small display outside each room showing the gravity value in the room. Now that's what's on the display double gravity is on. Then why doesn't he respond at all? A boy leaned closer in disbelief, widening his eyes to see more clearly. Lu Xing in the room looked indifferent, as if nothing had happened to him. Not even the expression has changed. Could it be? Another boy was just about to express his guess, but this time, Lu Xing suddenly raised his hand in the room and threw a punch. The first was so fast that it was impossible to see. The two of them were stunned and looked at each other. That was the sound of a fist breaking through the air. The three were stupid. The gravity training room has sound insulation, and the sound inside will be weakened and deformed when it is transmitted to the outside, so the sound of the fist breaking through the air reaches their ears and only the faint sound of bubbles bursting is left. At this moment... Other trainees standing near the gravity room also noticed Lu Xing and started shouting to gather everyone. A boy couldn't help shouting. It's true. It's hard for me to even move a little in the double gravity room. This guy can still make a smashing sound? Anyone with a bit of martial arts knowledge knows it. If you want to hit the air with your fists, you have to punch fast enough. That can't be real. What the? What is going on? A boy shouted in disbelief. Lu Xing was pretty content after experiencing double gravity pressure. He felt like keeping going until he reached his limits to test out his full bodily potential. At this moment, the people gathered outside watched helplessly as Lu Xing in the room put down his fist, walked towards the controller, and pressed on it. As Chao Yong watched Lu Xing moving towards the controller, he was confused and thought to himself, Is he stopping because he can't endure it any longer? As the notification sound of the gravity change came, everyone outside felt a tremor. All of them suddenly looked at the display screen outside the room. They saw a line of clear words pop up on the display screen quadruple gravity has been turned on. He is taking on quadruple gravitational force. Chao Yong blurted out in confusion. The eyes and mouths of all of them slowly opened at the same time. Their expressions and movements were synchronized and they turned their heads to look at the scene in the gravity chamber. This time, Lu Xing in the room finally changed and reacted a little. The relaxed and casual feeling on Lu Xing's face disappeared, and his expression seemed to be a little more serious. So, this is what increased gravitational force feels like. Very well, let's give it a go. Lu Xing said to himself. Lu Xing knelt down on the floor under the pressure of quadruple gravitational force. The boy standing beside Chao Yong criticized Lu Xing. Seems like he cannot hold anymore. Lu Xing moved his body to get up from the floor and then began to move his hands and feet slowly. 
a boy made two sounds full of exclamation marks from his mouth with a shocked face. Four times gravity! Can you still move under four times gravity? Please pinch me to see if I am dreaming. Both of them had ghost-like expressions. Xiao Lin, who just finished her psychic training some moments before, was passing through the training hallway. I am so tired, the instructor was really strict. Chief Dong Qingxue had been giving tough training to Xiao Lin. Because of the matter related to Lu Xing, he had already rejected Qing Xue's offer as well as destroyed her plans to use him as a whetstone for other trainees to progress rapidly. While passing through the hallway, Xiao Lin noticed several trainees outside the gravity training room. Why are there so many people over there? Xiao Lin thought to herself. She rushed over to the place where everyone was gathered. They had ghost-like expressions on their faces, and their expressions were full of sluggishness, with mouths wide open, staring in a direction continuously. Xiao Lin asked them, What is it? What are you looking at? But no one answered. She looked in the direction of the gravity room glass. Someone was taking on quadruple gravitational force. She got startled after seeing the one person she is most afraid of. It was Lu Xing, doing exercises with ease under four times gravitational force. Ha! Huh. How can it be Lu Xing? Xiao Lin voiced out her thoughts subconsciously. At the same time, watching Lu Xing performing under quadruple gravitational force Chao Yong fall back to the fall and sat down there in confusion wondering about the events that transpired. Why? Why? Just why is he so strong? Chao Yong's heart was beating hard, and with a pale face, he could not understand the logic. Wasn't he asleep for a whole month? Shouldn't I have already surpassed him by now? So what is the reason that even after sleeping for a whole month he is still far ahead of me? Chao Yong thought hard, but he could not find the reason. All the trainees just stood there, watching Lu Xing in the room continue to move and the speed of the movement is getting faster and faster, and the frequency is getting higher and higher. I have made progress today. I lasted more than twenty seconds under twice the gravity. Lu Xing stopped his body movements, his face full of calm. The gravity training room was more interesting than he had imagined. It should be said that it is very suitable for his current state. After a month of hard work, Lu Xing whose abilities have skyrocketed in all aspects, needs an environment that can constantly provide him with pressure to settle down. Doubling the gravity has almost no effect on me, it just feels a little more burden on my body, as if the air has become thicker, and it takes more effort to do the same action as usual. With four times the gravity, this feeling is even more obvious. At first, even breathing was a little uncomfortable. But it's just discomfort, staying used to it too. Lu Xing thought about it, walked towards the control panel, and pressed the plus button on it. Gravity, double it again. Five times the gravity. Everyone standing outside the gravity room was shocked and some shouted. Five times gravity, everyone quickly come over. Till now no one in the current training camp has reached five times gravity. Even Chao Yong who had a stone physique only reached up to four times gravity. A sudden pressure suddenly added to Lu Xing. Lu Xing felt that his body was sinking fiercely, and the whole person seemed to have suddenly fallen into a quagmire, and it became more and more difficult to move. This pressure is almost over. Lu Xing's eyes lit up slightly, and he took a deep breath. Now, it's time to experiment with my new gains during this time. Switch, breath of earth. In an instant, Lu Xing's breathing changed. This is an indescribable change. Lu Xing's chest began to rise and fall according to a strange rhythm, and his body swayed strangely. His feet were firmly on the ground. Through the thick floor cushion, it seemed that an invisible force poured into his body through the ground. This is one of Lu Xing's harvests in this month's hard work. One of the special breathing methods learned from the advanced chapter of Natural Breathing Method Breath of the Earth Although Lu Xing is still far from comprehending the corresponding earth attribute inner strength, what he can grasp now is enough to help him a lot. Outside the training room, all the people who gathered here to watch took a deep breath when they saw this. At this time, the door of this small room was already crowded with people. At the same time, 
people continued to run in from the eight entrances and exits of the venue and rushed over. Among them, there was Yang Yuan who had just arrived with someone. Chao Yun was stunned for a moment when he heard these discussions, then rushed over quickly, slamming away the crowd with a sullen face. The news quickly spread in a small area. The people surrounding the one-way glass turned their heads one after another and looked at Chao Yun with a strange looks. There's a good show to watch now. At first glance, Chao Yun's pupils shrank suddenly. Can he still stand up? Chao Yun turned his head in disbelief and looked at the small display next to him. The crowd took the initiative to open a line of sight, and someone shouted jokingly. Chao Yun, don't look at it, it is indeed five times, and the display screen is not broken. Chao Yun glared at the man fiercely, then turned to look back at the training room. A look of shock and disbelief quickly appeared on his face. Five times the gravity, really five times gravity. Under such pressure, how did Lu Xing do it? Chao Yong has a mysterious and powerful talented martial arts teacher who guides him online every night. He has too many points to use up. He is ten times more than others in the gravity training room every day, and the progress of his blood value is also a thousand miles. Under four times the gravity, even blinking his eyes is hard, let alone standing and swaying like Lu Xing. Chao Yong put his hands on the one-way glass window, his eyes fixed on the room. His expression was hideous and exaggerated, and his appearance was even a bit funny. At this time, no one could laugh. In the room, a tall and straight young man was standing in the center of the room, his body swaying slightly with a special rhythm, his breathing was gentle, and his handsome face was calm. The breath of the earth can reduce the pressure of about 10% under five times the gravity. Lu Xing silently came up with data in his heart. It's already a fantastic effect. The concept of the natural breathing method is already very obvious, that is, the unity of man-nature, so that practitioners can 100%, or even 120%, exert their combat effectiveness in any environment. The power of the 11th level exercises can only be understood after real practice and experience. Five times the gravity is almost suitable for my current practice under normal conditions. At five times the gravity, I should be able to barely perform the movements in the stellar body refining technique, and if I go up, it is probably enough. However, Lu Xing knew that this was under normal conditions. The stellar body refining technique cannot be exposed to outsiders casually. So, he also has to seek pressure, greater pressure the pressure that can force him to the limit. In this case, then continue to increase the gravity multiplier. Lu Xing calmly walked towards the panel and pressed the button lightly. Lu Xing can't hold it anymore, he's ready to turn off the gravity effect. After all, it's under five times the gravity. It's amazing to be able to last for so long. If you asked me, I can't support it for a second. Outside the training room. Everyone saw Lu Xing taking the remote control through the window. Almost everyone subconsciously thinks that Lu Xing has reached his limit and is ready to stop practicing. A group of people gathered in front of the display screen at the door of the room. Chao Yong also wandered in the crowd. His expression was solemn, but his eyes were very eager. Obviously, he was also very curious about this matter. A group of people huddled in front of the small display screen all of them trying their best to move forward, and the faces of the most crowded people were almost stuck on the display screen. In an instant, everyone fell silent. Their eyes were fixed on the small display screen, and their expression was like seeing a ghost. Someone choked out a sentence, opened and closed it, but couldn't get a word out of it. They saw that on the small display, a line of clear words displayed. Six times gravity is on. Lu Xing did not leave the training room. Chao Yong stood in the crowd, staring at the big six characters on the screen, with a dull expression. At this moment, under the watchful eyes of everyone, the numbers on the display change again. Seven times gravity is on! In an instant, the crowd totally exploded. That's all for today. If you like the next part of this manhwa just comment below. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to like. Subscribe and comment for getting epic content on this channel. See you next time.